I think United can win it, but I think if you look at what Nuno's done at Wolves and the competitiveness that they show every time they step on the field, you would think in an FA Cup where it doesn't quite have the same mm. maybe glory that it had 30, 40 years ago. And so maybe certain managers don't quite take it as seriously. I still think Man U has, has the squad that can easily go into Wolves, make some changes, and, and get a victory. But I think it's going to be tough because I truly believe that, that Wolves are that team that when they step on the field, they're ready to fight for everything. And when you have an, a competition like the FA Cup, the way it's perceived right now, I think the team that takes it the most serious sometimes has the best chance. Is this more of an important game now for Man United, given recent results which have been inconsistent? Well, that, that, I mean, I think that's really been the stable of Man U is inconsistency. Is they just have, they come up with one result and you think, okay, now they're going to kick on and they're going to go on a grid run and then they lose a game they shouldn't and then there's a draw somewhere. And you, you would think that, yes, this could be a great opportunity. Make a couple changes, give some guys some opportunities, have a great result away at, at Wolves, and then continue to, to push on then in the league. But I just don't know if that's going to be the case. When you see someone like Manchester United, who, or some team like Manchester United, that are going for top four, this is going to be their best chance of success this season. So I get the change in goal, because right. Romero's a super right. goalkeeper sure. as a backup. But until we see that lineup, if we see a lineup that is pretty strong, we'll know what this competition means to Oli. If we see one that isn't pretty right. strong, what does it tell us? Well, I think and that's the surprising thing. I think if it does tell us that they're not that serious about the FA Cup, look, we all know Liverpool's going to win the league, bar mm -hmm. the biggest catastrophe in Premier League history. But an opportunity for Man U to be at a cup final, to be, for Ole Gunnar Solskjaer, is huge. Yeah. To, so it, I would be surprised if they kind of came into this competition and just kind of blew it off and said, okay, we're going to concentrate everything on that final spot in Champions League. But then in saying that, think of what the financial incentives are, the differences between the two, between winning the FA Cup and making sure that you're in the Champions League. So I understand both sides, but I still think winning a trophy for Solskjaer would be massive. Huge. The FA Cup means more to who? Them or them? I think if you look at the fans, I think it's equal. I think both fans are, understand that. Um, I think if you look at Wolves, Wolves aren't going to make Champions League. Wolves could have an opportunity to get themselves into a cup final, which would be, which would be massive. Well, they, could win the, they could win the Europa League and get into Champions League, but you're right. True. They're not going to do it through the league. So therefore, a silverware for them. I mean, they won the Anglo-Scottish Cup at the start of the 1970s. <laughs> That's the type of silverware you're right. talking about. Right. So, and, and I think in, in how competitive they've been over the last couple of years, there's no question that if you come across some of the big boys who maybe don't take it quite as seriously, mm. we've seen some, some teams, some smaller sides, get themselves into cup finals over the last several years that maybe you wouldn't have seen yeah. 20 years ago. Sure. So I see no reason why the confidence with Wolverhampton wouldn't be thinking that, this could be a year that they could find themselves in a cup final. But then at the same time, when you are of a storied club like Manchester United, things haven't been maybe what they were mm. several years ago. For a young manager to win the FA Cup is huge. It's a big thing. We'll not know until about an hour and 50 minutes before kickoff when the team lines are out how seriously each team is taking this competition. <sighs> Well, thank you very much for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for live streaming, premium content, and let's not forget as well, ESPN FC, seven days a week. Subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.